Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today let's talk about cutlery. Ensuring your cutlery is spotless should be a crucial part of your home cleaning. This doesn't mean you have to deep clean it or shine it on a daily basis but you can do it every season like now during fall cleaning or before a dinner party. Maybe you host Thanksgiving or Christmas and you want your cutlery to shine. You can see here my cutlery drawer is long overdue, is full of smudges, crumbs and so dirty. So I decided this is the perfect chance to show you the process of making my cutlery like new. Foggy cutlery not only looks bad, it may also be concealing tiny bits of dirt that may endanger your health. Even if you put your cutlery in the dishwasher right after use, Chances are it will still get a buildup of tarnish and water that will become increasingly more apparent with time. Luckily this problem can be fixed by deep cleaning your silverware every couple of months or so by using this method. All you need is boiling hot white vinegar. You will emerge the cutlery into it for 10 minutes. It will clean your grimy cutlery that has food baked on or watermarks. Here you can see how mine looks like, not very bad, but it still has some watermarks. The hot vinegar will soak off anything stuck on the cutlery and will shine, disinfect and remove watermarks, caked on food and streaks. Don't worry about the odor vinegar smell will disappear immediately. An important thing is prevention. Prevention is always better than remediation. Devoting a little extra time to this during your cleaning will ensure your cutlery remains in good shape for longer. Prevent it from becoming tarnished by making sure to wash it as soon as possible. If you leave cutlery lying around with bits of food still on it, acid and salt in the food will eventually damage it. Right after washing, use a soft lint-free towel to dry out each piece of cutlery. If you leave it to dry on its own, detergent and water will probably leave marks. The last step is to dry your cutlery using a lint-free cloth or towel. The most important thing is to dry it while it's still wet. If one item dries off, put it back into the vinegar. I want to thank you for taking time of your busy day to watch my video. I hope it helps you clean faster and easier. Here you can see the vinegar with all the dirt inside. This is what my cutlery left behind. And this is the final result. Sparkling clean, no more watermarks, no more cloudy cutlery. Ready for the holiday season. You won't throw away all that vinegar. Now I will tell you what to do with it. Grab some baking soda and clean all your drains in your home. Kitchen, bathroom, bathtub, all of them. 
I usually put down the drain a scoop of baking soda, then vinegar until it's not bubbling up anymore. Then let the water run for a few minutes. It will unclog and clean your drains and it also gets rid of any bad odor. Now let's show how my cutlery drawer looks like. I removed everything, vacuumed the crumbs, cleaned it with a disinfectant and a microfiber cloth, then put everything back. Now I like what I see. I hope today's video inspired you to do a deep clean of your cutlery drawer or another area in your home that needs to. If you like videos like this, I have on my channel a variety of playlists where you can find what you need from cleaning hacks, laundry hacks, stain removal, home projects, puppery, cleaning helper products, shoe cleaning tips, folding, appliances cleaning tips, organization and much more. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and see you next time. Bye!